Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Episode 11. Uh, 12. Every episode I do this. We're back after our um, pretty demoralising loss in the first game against Nottingham. We've got some new trainers. Also, we've got some new gloves. You can see these are the Bradbury's own gloves to match with the bat, obviously. They were very kind to, to give us those. And also, if we have a look at the pads, again, we've got some nice Bradbury pads as well there. So we're all matching. We've got Lancashire up next uh, to show you. Yep, we've got Lancashire up next to our third in the table. So they're going pretty well. If we click on uh, their players, you can see in the run scoring chart, a few players to be, to be watching out for. Liam Livingston, I think he's the captain. Very destructive batsman. Keaton Jennings, we all heard of Keaton Jennings. He's played for England many, many times. Didn't quite do it for England, but he's a consistent performer, as you can see, for, for his county. Josh Butler is there, but he's only played the three games, so I'm not sure whether he's off on England duty. And of course, we've got Glenn Maxwell as well. I wonder if we can have a look at the bowling statistics, can we? I'm sure we can. Ah, yeah, right click. Jesus. So. Yeah, so if we look at the uh, wickets, we've got Matt Parkinson, who bowls at leg spin. He's taken how many wickets? 31 wickets, so he's going very well this year. A good all-round team, really. Obviously, we're playing at Emirates Old Trafford at their place. Let's see if we can bounce back and, and get a, some sort of result from this game. Pretty unchanged team, really. Bat, bat. Bat, bat, bat. Oh yeah, for once they actually listen to me. Let's see what they can do. Look at the size of Alex. Can't get over it, he's massive. Look at joint. Don't know why if the umpire gives him out, he don't just beat them up. So it's gonna be Richard Gleason to open the bowling. Yep. Oh, and there's boys, first ball. Shabby start from Lancashire, very shabby. Shoddy, shabby, I forget which one it should be. Good start from the lads, 78 for one. Sam Haynes just come in, arguably our best player, really. Um, so, good start from our two openers. Can we keep it up? Oh, and that's a big inside edge for four. It's gone past the keeper. Can't really see, to be fair. Yeah, big thick inside edge, and the keeper can't get there. Going along at four and a half and over as well, so um, a good run rate. Doing very well. Wait till we get in. Can't wait to mess that up. This is the danger, man. Parkinson. That leg spinner. Ooh. Get nervous watching from the crowd. Well, from the dressing room, I should say. Get nervous. Luckily, I've got a nice warm cup of tea. Oh, that's a wide. I know it's hit it. Never mind. Looks a decent pitch, to be fair. Went down and had a look before the toss. Bit of a poke. We've just lost uh, Brody Compton. He went for a well played 63. Sam Haynes still there. He's joined by Jack Lynch. The lesser of the two Jacks in this team. Right then lads, we're at the crease now, 155 for 3, we've made our way to 7 off 16, we're still there with Sam Hayne at the other end, who's on 44, he's going very well, we've got Faulkner in, is that down the ground, are we going to run? Yes we are. Yep. Oh yep, yeah, we'll run that as well, that's a nice shot, I could run away for 4, could do, oh yeah it has, and that's his 50 I think. I think it should be, yeah, well played son. Right, so we've got my move bowling from the far end. Yep, yeah, we'll let that one go. Fun fact for you all at home, the ground actually used to be facing the other way, they turned the square around. Round about, how many years ago was it? I'd say about five, five or six years ago. That pavilion that you see in the background used to be at point and now obviously it's right behind the bowler's arm, which is much more pleasing to the eye. Hmm, something smells good downstairs. I don't know what it is, but someone's cooking something nice, but we can't get distracted. Yep. We've got a job to do. Oh, that's another edge. Flew down to third man. Yep. Oh, that's in front of square. It will come back for two. Might be three actually. Yeah, we'll come back for three. We've got a man under the lid. Hopefully we don't hit him like we keep doing. Oh, that's wide. That's four as well. Bread and butter, really, for us in the form that we're in. Yep. Oh, that's another edge as well. That's going to go for four. That's three edges I've seen so far. 
batting with a polo mint. Oh, that's in no middle. Oh, hey. Two shorts, two straight. So easy just to clip it off our hips for four. Short boundaries, well done there. Any kind of additions you'd like in this career mode, by all means, please put them in the comment section. I know I've been having a few comments from people as far as India that watch these videos, so a big thank you to them. Keep watching, obviously, tell all your friends and let's keep growing the channel. There's going to be a lot more of these videos. Oh, sweep. Careful, careful. Around the wicket, which makes it much easier for us to get the sweep out. I know a lot of you at home don't like me sweeping, you get very nervous, but I like sweeping, it's a good way to score, so we're going to keep doing it, we're going to stick to our guns. Yep. Yep. Oh, that's what we wanted to see. That's what we all came to see, that back foot punch. Beautiful shot. Yes. Oh, inside edge, just past the stumps, we'll sneak one. Oof, that was close. That was a silly shot, Sam. Don't know what he was trying to do there. Hit it over extra cover. I'd be daft. Where was the need for that? A bit of Glenn Maxwell now. I don't think we've placed in his national bowler yet. Well, I don't think Glenn Maxwell is in his national bowler. Not when he bowls crap like that. Big wide half volley. It's just saying hit me. And we hit it. Too easy, Glenn. Yep. Oh, that's four, that's four. Yeah, open the face. Didn't mean to, but that's where it went. Just open the face a little bit, there you can see it. I'm gonna try and sweep this outside the leg stump behind square. Yep. Oh, that's in front of square. Oh, it's on square. Close enough there, I'm pretty happy with that. This is dedicated backing up here. Look at this, fling himself at it. Who is it? Is that Layman? Yeah, it is, yeah. Look at this. You want to back up? Give it the full length. <laughs> what commitment from the man. Ooh. Another one. Stop, but it's not going to stop the two that we need to bring up our second 50 in as many games. What a start to our career this has been. Yep, nice and reserved. 50 off 78 balls. Start again, the coach would shout from the sidelines. <laughs> start again. Yep. Oh, that's four. That's too wide. It's too wide, Glenn. It's not going to work. We've stopped it out there as well. Fair play to him. You come back. Oh, I am coming back. Yep. Yeah, one. Yes. Oh, hello. Let's give up the kitchen sink. Alex Thompson is the new man in, under a bit of pressure um, from that first ball duck, and I didn't. I don't think he scored many in the first innings of the last game. Right, that's the over, and I'm going to the toilet. Right lads, we're back and I can confirm what's cooking downstairs is stir fry. No wonder it smells so nice. I'm going to get some lights up, but there is a job at hand. Oh no, he's definitely nicked that. Oh yeah. Oh Alex, it's not going well for you, is it son? It's not going well for you at all. I'd drop him if it was me. Did he get seven? Yeah, it's just not working, is it? Who's the new man in? I think it's our mate Michael. Yeah, here it is. Here he is. With his new sponsorship, Grand Nichols called him up and says, We like we like your batting. We're going to sponsor you. Good play. Fair play to him. Yep. Oh my god, his edge first ball. Oh no, that's out as well. That's caught cool. off the pad. Just, yeah, it's off the pad. It loops up in the air and it's caught. Cool. I think Grand Nichols might be asking for that sponsorship back now, so in the way you keep going. He's committed to playing forward, which is fine. He middles it. Bang, bang. Now, I don't know what's happened there, but bang, bang. I think it hits his pad or his foot, or I don't know. Up in the air and caught. Now, 
I don't know what to say actually, I don't know what I was going to say to that. It's just unlucky, isn't it? Yeah. That puts more ownership on us now, of course, to keep batting, you know, and see it through and back with the tail. I mean, Ashton's not a tail ender, but. Oh, if he keeps batting like that, he is. Oh my god, he's all over him like a rash. Oh my god, all of a sudden we're trying to get ourselves out, this is not good. I'm going to have a word. Oh, Jack, that's not how to bat the whole innings. Right then, that takes us to T, I think. 273 for 6. Hayne with 86. We're there with 59. Crompton with 62. Wickets are shared between Parkinson, who's got 3 for 55. Gleeson, 2 for 53. And Faulkner. Kind of in the balance. I just want one on the hip. One on the hip. Well, it's not on the hip, but we'll take it. Oh, what a horrible shot that was. Like a squat. Gotta show you that one, that was awful. Like a horrible front foot, pull, squat, swat. Oh dear, that's not pretty easy that. Jeffrey Boycott would be rolling around in his grave. He's not dead, but if he was. Oh wow, that was close. Well bold. Oh, oh there's a man there. <laughs> Didn't even know there was someone there, I thought it was four. <laughs> oh dear. What a shot that was, I thought that was definitely four, I didn't even see him. He's not there anymore, he's gone. That's not out, it's going down leg by miles. That'd be daft. It's going down, and it's high. Yeah, that'd be daft. I was that out? I have a lot of faith in this lad. A lot of faith in this lad, he can bat. I know he can, I've seen him in the net, he's a good player, good technique. She's just got to stay with me. Oh, what a seed that is. Pitched on and moved. Oh, that's gone for four. Is that going in the air over the top? I think it has. We'll take it there, will we? Oh, it's gone straight in the gap. Oh my god, where's he bowled that? That's horrendous, mate. That's awful. Four wides. I think so. Should be six for that. New balls, please. New ball. Uh, eight down. Oh, this is getting very awkward now. I'm not sure how to play it. 332 for eight. We're on 84. Yeah. You're giving us a lot of ones and singles. For now, I'm going to take them. I'm going to take them. And then when we're nine down, then I'll, I'll think about changing things. I've brought the field in now for the last ball, so if it's short, I'm going to try and pull it over the top. Anything else, I think I might just leave it or just let it go. Oh, that was short, and it's... Oh, it's dropped. Oh my god, it's dropped. What a horrendous attempt at a catch. I think that was the life... Ah, oh, very professional, Jack. Right, is this a moment or what? Look at this. Uh, sure, it was what we wanted, really back of a length and we've tried to get underneath it and pull it we haven't got any of it and it's dropped short at square leg sorry by Gleason. oh dear well he's a bowler but dearie dear there's a gap over point there's a gap in front of mid wicket behind square leg about there yep that's another four good man good man and there's two balls for miles to survive can he do it Oh, what's that gone? It's an overthrow. Sorry, I wasn't even watching. I was looking down. It's gone for overthrows. Oh, what a time that is. What's happened there? So we've, we've minced it outside, out to deep square leg. It's come in from the boundary. Hang on, we've got to have a look at this. Hit it out there for one. Who picks it up? Is that Livingston? Yep, in it comes. Is the sun in the keeper's eyes? Because he hasn't moved and neither is the guy backing up. The sun must be in their eyes. And that's gone for four overthrows. Oh my God, what a moment that is. 97 now, only three runs away. Seven overs left. 98, we've got a, everyone on the boundary except for cover and mid wicket. Yep, I'm going to take the one. Oh, do we come back for two? Oh, it's four. We've got it farther than that. It's four. That's our second hundred. We punch the air. Get in. What a magnificent start to our career. Wow. Two games and two hundreds. 
Well, I hope you all enjoyed that back at home. Um, our second 100 didn't last much longer though. As you can see, we had our off stump completely ripped out of the ground. A pretty good ball to be fair, just played down the wrong line, but to be honest with you, I don't really care. Um, it was a good knock, probably our best knock of the, of the whole series so far. Lancashire have a good attack, they're doing well in the league and we carried that innings. Um, we finished on 357 all out. You see our 100 there supported by Sam Hain. In terms of Lancashire's innings, we had a few overs left in the day. Obviously, they've got Keaton Jennings and Hasib Hamid, who used to play for England, both ex-England openers, actually. See if we could grab a wicket before the end of the day, or two. As you'll see shortly, we did manage to grab one, and it was the, the young Hamid, who was caught behind off a pretty good ball from, from Sutherland, who's a new bowler, I don't know who he is. Um, a little inside edge, just an, uh, one that nipped back in and... And got it really. Uh, so a great start. Great start. Gone for one. Hasn't been in great form really since he's uh, he's not playing for England. He hasn't really scored any runs to be honest with you. But little inside edge, and that was the one we could that we wanted before the end of the day. And they finished on a, on eight for one. You could see that edge that went past us. First ball to Rob Jones. I just didn't see it. <laughs> Completely didn't see it. Start of day two. You can see the sun shining. A few more played and misses, Keaton Jennings played well, as he always does, pretty reliable performer now, uh, on the county stage that is. We were brought into the attack with the score, I think there were two down, 40 for two, yeah 42 for two, and then we were put down to final leg, which I wasn't happy about. These two lads look good together though. I think they put on a 50 partnership between the two of them. Uh, Tom Bailey as well supporting. Yeah, you can see the 50 partnership there. And, and looking to rebuild the innings, we were then put a bat pad, which is very exciting, um, especially when this ball was hit. And literally, as you can see, nearly whacked us on the head. Very close. But eventually we did get the breakthrough and that was it there in quite strange fashion. Um, it was just a little inside edge actually, the replay will show it. It was just a little inside edge and that removed Jennings for 63. A little inside edge onto the pad, up in the air and it was caught by first slip. And that was the breakthrough that we needed. Uh, Livingston come to the crease and Livingston of course being one of their best players. We had one edge that dropped short and that was pretty much the only chance that he gave us as you'll see. We were then brought into the attack um, with four wickets down. And we did manage to pick up a, a few wickets, as you'll see. We've got Faulkner to drag one on. A little inside edge onto his stumps, and I think we knocked off some clean out of the ground there. I think it was. Yeah. Big wicket, James Faulkner. Quite a dangerous player. Australian international. And then that brought uh, Parkinson to the crease, who went in, in similar fashion, only two balls later. Uh, one that bounced a little bit. I think he caught his elbow or his glove or something and just bounced down onto the stumps. That was a bit more unlucky. Yeah, you got to feel hard done by there. Uh, I think that was a duck I think he went for. Yeah, zero, nothing. At this point, we're doing pretty well. 241 for eight. We lead by over 100. But as you can see, Livingston managed to get his 100. He played really well. Um, probably the best innings I've seen on this game. 101, you can see there. And he didn't stop there. He kept going. He kept going, as you'll see shortly. They batted the whole of the day, Lancashire did. That was the one chance that we had, that little fine edge that would have gone straight to first slip, but we didn't have one. We would have snaffled that straight down his throat, probably. Yeah. So as I was saying, Lancashire managed to bat the whole day. Uh, I think Livingston finished on 137 not out. They were eventually bowled out at the start of day three for 356. So we lead by one run, and that's going to win part one. So thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe, but you always do. And be looking out for part two.